And now at 6, school security scramble on the eve of the first day of school. Miami-Dade County School District making last-minute deals to meet the state's new mandate. That mandate is to provide an armed officer at every school come Monday morning, the first day of classes in Miami-Dade. Up till yesterday, about 30 schools were without designated officers. CBS 4's Gary Nelson is live in Sweetwater with today's developments. Gary. Well, that number has dwindled considerably since yesterday as the Miami-Dade school superintendent has worked hard to make sure there is an officer in every school come Monday. Sweetwater, the tiny town of Sweetwater, just today kicking in five cops for the effort. Miami-Dade school boss and mayor sealed a deal agreed two months ago that will see the county provide 100 police officers to staff schools. It's under a state mandate that every school have a cop or armed guard when classes begin. We did this because we have a duty and a moral obligation to protect our children. Superintendent Alberto Cavallo has worked months making deals with cities to provide cops to meet the new state law. It's come down to a scramble. Some 20 cities will provide officers to schools. Doral police agreeing to staff at 11, part of a cobbling together of a cavalry to the rescue. Oh, we stepped up to the plate. You know, we were given our marching orders by the city administration, and uh, we did the necessary. Uh, internal adjustments to re reallocate the personnel. Sweetwater, with only one school, has provided five cops, four to be used wherever the district wants. Carvalho has pointed in saying some communities haven't helped out. We will also continue to appeal to those city leaders that so far have not elevated this priority as the maximum priority of our community. The school system will have to draw on reserves. Just like teachers, we have substitute pools for police officers. Uh, we were hoping not to use it. That means some school police detectives will have to get in uniform and go to schools Monday. Miami-Dade students will not be unprotected. We are 100% confident uh, that we will go into Monday with every single school covered. And as Carvalho illustrated Friday, say cheese. Every visitor to schools will have to be issued a photo ID. Every faculty member, middle school and high school student will wear a photo ID. And 15,000 security cameras will be monitored in real time at schools across the district. It's estimated that the additional police officers alone could cost some $75, $80 million a year, perhaps expenses that the county, the school district, and municipalities largely are bearing. The state is paying for just a tiny fraction of that amount. We're live at the Sweetwater Police Department. Gary Nelson, CBS 4 News.